guys I just wanted to show you how to set up your basking area when you get it so basically you're gonna get it like this face down is this way this is how you're gonna put it on your tank I'll go ahead and take this out um, you're gonna put it down on your tank like this and these little holes I'll get to it soon but basically I'll show you with the other one I have but you're gonna get it with um, I have eight zip ties I have an extra one in here in case you need it um, and the two clamps the basking ramp, well, the um, basking area's ramp, and the little side pieces, which I will show you how to set up soon. So, so once you get your basking area out of the box, you're just going to put it on the rim of the tank. I'm using my 20 gallon for right now because this one fits my 20 and the heater's kind of in the way. But you basically make it fit on the side, push it in. So now it's on the rim of the tank. Once you get it put into place, you're gonna wanna get your clamp and clamp the basking area into place like so. And you do the exact same thing with the other side and you plop the clamp straight on like that. So now the turtle can't push it down when it's trying to climb up. Once you're done clamping the platform into place, you're gonna wanna get these little pieces and align them with the side of the basking area. Then once you've got the side piece aligned with it, with the side of the uh, platform, you're going to want to get two zip ties, get the top and the bottom, and then tighten them. This is hard to do with one hand. Um, you're going to want to tighten them, and then until they're sturdy. And now when the turtle's running out of the basking area to get back in the water, they can't get out of the side because they're just going to hit a wall. Once you've done that on both sides, you're going to want to get little clippers or scissors or whatever and cut off the excess part of the zip tie. And there you go. Once you've attached the little side pieces, you can go ahead and attach the platform on or you can just do completely the opposite. Do the platform first, then do the little clips and then do this, whichever one you prefer. Um, you're going to want to find the middle and if there's like a little and like this, make sure that's facing towards the water because that's the weakest part and you're not going to want that up here. So you're going to line it up with the middle and then you're going to want to zip tie it together. So then you're going to get the, then you're going to get three zip ties, put one on the far end, one on the other far end, and then one in the middle. And then you're going to zip tie them together. I'll go ahead and do that in a second, but I can't really film it because I have to prop it up at an angle. Oh yeah, and make sure you prop it up at an angle because it won't bend down after you tighten it all the way. So I'm going to tighten these and show you what it looks like afterwards. So once you're done attaching the little ramp to the basking area, cut off the little extra, the excess parts of the zip tie, and then you're done and your turtle can happily enjoy it. So once your basking area is all set up, this is what it should look like. Thank you for watching and I hope this helped you out in setting up your basking area and I hope that your turtle loves this. Thanks for watching guys, bye.